Tinginan lang tayo. Walang usapan. Tinginan lang. Ating stove. Anak. You can do serious cooking. Walang limitation. Oh! Oh, soup. <laughs> okay, I think gutom na yung mga kasama. Mm, kaya na tayo. Paros puro gulay kasi sobrang daming tortilla nila Chef JP Meron sila doon bagay, yempo, dinosaur, demonyo Lahat ng pwede na ito eh, meron sila doon eh Wala silang demonyo, nang kape uh, I'm just sort of like roasting them to soften and then I, uh, I don't know yet. So, salt lang muna and then titimplay natin siya mamaya. Mamaya. Here comes the stingray. Shredded cabbage, chicken oil, garlic oil, and asin lang. Halo natin. Tapos, ito, luto na. Puno natin. Hindi ko pa alam saan siya papunta. Gawin ko muna lahat na component and then simplang ko na siya sa dulo. Mga dalawang oras pa. Tapos sana, titigil yung ulan. Nilagyan ko ng laurel. Tapos itong mushroom powder ni Ninong Rai. Kung walang mushroom powder, pwede namang ibang powder. Ibang powder? Mm -hmm. Nandyan na naman yung ulan. Nagpapasarap dito yung chicken oil. Pwede na siguro to. Woo! Lakas nun ah. Uh, Sira muna yung bintana. Chicken oil ulit. Hmm, daglang pa natin. Ayan. Mushroom powder. Laurel. Isa. Buti lang kanina na kapag luto na tayo. Napakain na natin. Naku. Ito yung tawag na talagang adventure. Talagang pasubo oh, tayo. Bataka niya pa, bataka niya pa yung ano. So pala si Maui. Maui Taylor. Ano pwesto? Basta pa rin ako. Ito, um, shrimp skin, ghee. So sobrang bango. Gamitin ko yung oil. Lulutuin ko yung ating piece. Yun, nabasa, natuloy yung asin. Ayaw na lumabas. Okay. One down. One down. Ano, ano, one there! Sina ka! Chili garlic. Curry powder. Then, just mix it. So si Kim, he's gonna blitz it. I'm gonna add more oil para mapure niya. That's the whole lot. And since I added more oil, I'll add a little bit more curry powder. Then a little bit more chili garlic. You can always add, but you can never remove. Where's the best of us? Nabuhos kung pero so let us add sugar and lemon. Or calamansi. So I added some feta cheese or any salty cheese. Give it a taste. <clears throat> Six chefs. It's not there yet. <laughs> I have a job opening for a kitchen. You think it's good? How about we add some chopped tomatoes? Or it doesn't need it. Tomatoes? Yeah. I'm gonna put it on top of that fish. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. Hot water. Then, we add some cheese powder. It looks like egg. 
I know, right? It has such a beautiful color. I'll let you taste it. You'll love it. Max, so this this is actually dedicated for you because you've been hanging out in the kitchen. So I'll make something. I'll make a vegetable dish that's kind of kid friendly. So look, it's starting to thicken. Okay, it's good. It's like. See? Kids don't lie. It's like what? The cheese sauce that we sometimes dip with chips. Nachos. I'm gonna put it here. Oh wow. That's gonna be good. So it's it's lumpy because I don't have a whisk, but then it will melt. Come here, Tasha. Go get a spoon. Patry ko kaniyo ng Hindi ko sabihin sa ano nilagay ko. Na. <laughs> Alam mo na. <laughs> na mo. Tasha, come here. Yon. Ano yon? Di ba kayo Aaron? Alam niyo na Pia. Alam niyo na no? Yes. <coughs> Parang nasa ano kung battery ng konte. Give up. Oh. Ano yun? Cheese. Quick melt? No. Ah, legit cheddar. Melted cheddar. Oh. <laughs> Sarap. Pero yung ratio, konti Baba lang. lang. Oh, so hindi mo alam na... Power, eh. oh. Para maumami lang siya. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. masabi yung chicken powder eh. Pero sabi ko, hindi naman papahula siya ang JP to kung chicken powder lang ito. <laughs> Sarap. Sarap. Ayun, so now we have a whisk. Ma ma mawawala na yung lumps niya. So ngayon, okay, may... Meron na tayong... Uh, ano to, assurance na... Na gustuhan nila. So ihulog ko na ito lahat dito. Tama nga si Kim. It's like so many moving parts. Yo! Okay, okay. What's going on here, Chef Kim? Ron, just a thing like peeled prawns marinated in this paprika, some mushroom powder. Ito yung pinakuluan nilang beef. Eh, dito kasi lagi may patikin. Yep. Uwi ko na lahat yan. <laughs> yan. Tapos dahil sinigang sa mushroom nga to, mushroom powder ang ilalagay natin. Ah, yung pala. Inyo. Galing, galing. Dati kasi, kapag gumagawa ko ng mga gantong kalokohan sa kusina, wala akong excuse. Hmm. Ngayon meron. Eh, wala kaming ibang ingredient eh, di ba? Oh. Ngayon may excuse na akong gawin ng kahit anong gusto ko. Pakukuloy na lang natin to hanggang Ready nang kumain. Ito yung pinakuluan nilang beef ribs kanina. The first thing we did. Five, six hours sa pinakuluan. Tapos, tinimplant siya ng batcho ingredients. Ngayon, sinlice ko lang yung beef ribs. Hinaluan ko lang ng spring onions. And lagyan ko lang siya ng fried garlic. And then, pwede na tayo mag-start. Kuha ko ng bowl, tapos... Uh, Hindi ko pinapakain. Hindi ko pinapakain, inuutusan ko. <laughs> <laughs> At saka ng kutsara. At saka ng kutsara. Para matikman mo to. Ito sa ko, karne lang. Walang sabaw. Ako rin, mahal din ako ng Chef JP. Kasi si Chef JP, magkakaroon na ng ano yan, overlander yan. Tapos i-regular namin ito. Ah, kumingit eh, oo. Saya natin, ano? Maglapit tayo ng isang lamesa dito, Chef. Beef belly fat. Dito. Yan, 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 yan. Actually, Chef, pwede dito ilagay ibang pagkain. Oo, sige. Ang cute naman yung fashion puppy, oh. Meron dalang sabi. Hahaha. 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 Pustahan, sandang porsyento mapapaso yan sa stainless ang buhay na tira mo. Tira mo, tira mo. Gusto mo kasi umawa, kanatapon yan eh. Suportahan mo. Mapapaso ako eh, hindi naman ako tanga kagaya mo. Ano? Backfire! Huwag mo i-zoom sa'yo, megapixel sa mukha niya. Grabe! Ano? Sobrang sarap. Alam mo yung ano? Yung flavors? Kaano sa bibig ko? Tapos alam mo yung... Yung beef? Grabe! Parang ako yung unang tao na kakain ng beef sa buong mundo. Grabe! Taba, pakain natin. Taba, sige, sige. Gaw! Oo, di na naman makakapray na bukas yan. Wow! Ah! Wala ibang ayan na! Grabe! Chef, baka kailangan pa isang videographer. Out ka na dyan. Family show yung ano. Family show yan. Shoutout sa mami ko. Mami! Artista na naman. Na pumunta rito para to celebrate this feast. We like to say thank you. Actually, this is Silent Sanctuary. It's a setup initially proposed by Joel. Kasi he was into overland, overlanding. 
So it became, uh, it's originally is a place for the deaf mutes. It's a school for deaf. Okay, so you are welcome here. Thank you for this celebration. And thank you for helping the deaf. That is the bottom line. Amen. Yes. Okay, and then I brought some toothpaste, of course. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, tandaan yung toothpaste nyo. Happy. Yes. Kung hindi, hindi kami happy. Thank you and uh, please take over, Chef. Okay. Over here, as they say, do not judge a book by its cover. This is a, <laughs> but this is a beautiful pork belly dish that we've been braising for the past five, six hours, and then we smothered it with some silent sanctuary sauce. Oh. With. <laughs> Ito, ito, ginawa ko to Ano to, yun yung uh, hinanap ko lahat ng root crop doon. Uh -huh. Tapos, uh, gagawin ko sana ng mash. Okay. Ito, pag-usapan natin na, lagyan natin ng pumpkin. Okay. So, basically, para siya, potato, sweet potato, taro, and pumpkin mash. Okay. Tapos, uh, meron siyang ghee, uh -huh. nag-split, ginamit ako ng egg to emulsify. Mm. So, iba. Tapos, meron siyang uh, feta cheese and uh, walnuts for texture. Tapos meron din tayong mustard sa taas. Ito kay Chef Jeric, yung stingray. Marinated vinegar sauce, soy sauce, vinegar, and then the fried ginger. Ah, fried ginger. Nice, fried ginger. Tapos yung sauce. Ginger. Yung sauce niya, pickles, tomato, and yung lemon. Okay. okay. Chili, little bit. Ito, gumawa ako ng parang gising-gising uh, pero wala tayong... Wala tayong coconut milk. Wala tayong coconut milk. Eh si Chef JP before, gumawa rin ng gising-giing sa bahay. Ang ginamit niya, evaporated milk. I remember that. So, kumuha ko ng inspiration na ginamit ko ay all-purpose cream. So, yari na naman po tayo dyan. <laughs> Tapos, very, very rich. Very rich siya. So, meron tayong uh, sweet pork sa taas. Basically, para siyang uncured tocino. Speaking of inspiration, uh, these two lovely ladies over here uh, were hanging out in the kitchen. Kaya na pagawa tuloy kami ng vegetables for kids. And kina kinakain na nila ngayon. They seem to enjoy it. So I guess it's pretty good. Uh, kayo tayo mga adults, maggulay rin tayo. Yes. <laughs> And then si Kim gumawa ng ating uh, parang gambas, no? Yes. Uh, gambas style uh, stir-fried prawns. Kanina medyo nahirapan kayo mag-peel. So now I peeled everything for you guys. Nah. <laughs> We sauteed it in uh, garlic. Tapos with ghee na rin. O onions garlic powder, uh, mushroom powder, as in yung marinate niya medyo strong. So the next one is uh, oyster tortang talong. Yeah. So actually the back story is we ordered oysters so akala ko yung dating with shells. Uh -oh. Pero yung dumating is yung uh, maliliit na oysters. walang shell. So 4 uh, kilos na, yan. Yes. 4 kilos mm, na May dalawang kilo pa na nasa ref. <laughs> So ang ginawa ko, Ayan. so we had the talong, so grinil ko muna. And then, sinama ko yung oysters sa bate. Okay. Then, it stopped with um, sauteed oysters lang, uh, bell pepper, and fresh onions. May mga campers tayo na nag-abot ng isda sa amin. Uh, siguro akala nila uh, pang paluto pang paluto ta kami pero hindi pero of course bilang kusinero luluto in rin namin <laughs> saan pa sila papaluto dito <laughs> so <laughs> fried pampano and then with sort of like a pumpkin curry dip nice and then sa ating sabaw, Yun, sabaw. kasi alam ko umuulan yes. kaya gumawa kami ng dalawang sabaw kasi syempre nothing beats a good warm soup on a rainy day so that one over there is a sort of like a beef belly beef ribs, bat choy flavored, without the noodles. And then, yung ginawa naman ni Ryan... Uh, ito pong ginawa ko, dapat po talaga crispy pata. Kaso, sa lakas ng ulan, baka po, po, pumotok yung mantiga natin dahil, dahil sa ulan. So, safety muna bago sarap, di ba? Uh -huh. So, tinuloy na lang namin ang sabaw. So, since wala kami ingredients for sinigang, ginamit namin what's on hand. And uh -huh. that's uh, mushroom sinigang. Nice. Uh, pata ginam, mushroom. Pata mushroom sinigang. Also, meron din akong ginawa dito, achara three ways. Kasi nakita ko, ang dami nilang ginagawang mga inihaw na bagay. So, gumawa lang ako ng quick achara three ways. Meron tayo dito ang palaya, meron tayo dito na panos, at meron tayo dyang uh, pipino lang. So, bagay na bagay yan dito sa ginawa ni Chef JP na 
Stingray and nice. with uh, with everything else, I guess. So yeah, free flowing. Enjoy. Uh, have a good night. Yes. Cheers. 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 Kaina, kaina. Uh, to better weather tomorrow. Yeah. Para matayo ang ten. Thank you, Joel. Low carb bachoy. Para parang ganon. Sa bati stingray. To prep prep tira mo. Pang patanggal pagod. Tatutunaw yung belly or yung fat. Sarap. Bang klase. That made my day. And in. I can go to sleep now. You know. Good morning. Good morning, Chef. Good morning. Johnny Christ. We have assorted longanitas for this uh, breakfast. That's great. Second life. Stingray. 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 Marinated the pagi or stingray. Shoot, ano lang, vinegar lang, salt. Challenge for sure. Yeah, kasi wala tayong to. No lang pa lang. Challenge. Tapos, sauce niya. Vinegar, onion, garlic. Konting dry chili para sisipa sa mukha nila. <laughs> Sipa sa mukha lang naman. Pwede na maging vlogger si Jerek. Oo nga eh. Well, learning from the best eh. Oo. Excuse me, Chef. Ay, ano po? Anong gagawin niyo? Salted egg? Mm -hmm. Salted egg. Ito lang yan. Saladang ano lang. Pag namahal, may pipino para mabadrip si Alvin. Uh, basically, yun. Natitin ako may protina pa ako magawa. Ang saksaka ng daing protina na eh. Kasi, meron akong i-donate na sauteed oysters. Tapos, halo natin sa sauteed egg mo. O, sige, sige, sige. Pampatigas ng tuhod. Pag ikaw, minuhay tayo ko mamaya, pre. Sabi ko sa'yo. A for Wagyu. Yan lang. Steak and eggs. Steak and eggs. Okay lang yun. Okay lang yun. Yung kapitbahay natin, may kayabangan ng kundi. Wala akong masabi siya. Wala akong counter. Malupit doon. Ako na yung inalok. Siya pa yung mayabang. Double duty ah. Walang may experience. There's so many things you can do with camp food. Basta i-prepare mo lang in advance. Ito, marinated na to sa kitchen namin. So when we got here, we opened the bag, slapped it on the pan and that's it. This was supposed to be grilled. Then since umuulan, Kim decided to just pan fry it, and it turned out better because na caramelized lahat na flavors. I'll give you a piece so that you can experience what we're talking about. Here you go. Gagawa ka ng oyster sauce. Medyo, medyo. So rin natin gumawa ng oyster truffle sauce. Di ko alam. Hindi ikaw na si ano? Papasita. Toyo, lagi natin yan. Tapos lagyan natin ng konti, konti lang, um, pwede po, moisin sauce. Tapos brown sugar. Hindi natin kung magmumukhang oil sauce. Siguro pwede mo itong lagyan ng adoy. So ito, gagamitin mo pa? Ito na, nakahalo. Ito na yung salada natin. This will be your best friend in camping. Cheese powder. What I realized lately, Yung cheese can be used in different ways, not just for pizza and pasta, but also for flavoring. Say your, yung gulay natin kahapon, the cabbage, nagusto ng mga kids. Dami siyang applications. Pwede rin siya example. Di ba we always have a cheese and hot dog. Yung hot dog habang niluto mo siya, lagay mo ng cheese powder. Ang nangyari yan, it will coat. The hot dog or the sausage. So, you know, na bubuo na yung cheese natin. Depende kung gaano ka kapal yung gusto mo. Kung gusto mo medyo runny, and then we stop here. Kung gusto niyo medyo gooey, then we continue. Ah, I know. Let's let's uh, jazz it up since we have it. Let's add truffle oil to this. Sheesh. Nakikinig kasi ako sa Tumat cooking truffle show truffle. ni Ninong Rai. Kaya napatruffle na rin ako dito. <laughs> Naku po. Bakit may bacon dyan? Cheesy bacon ang tawag. Oh so, this is for you, Aaron. Yay! 
Ray, kito ka no? Kito, kito, kito ka. Hindi, 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 hindi naman. O pwede ka dito. Pwede, pwede ako diyan. Wala wala ako restriction. Dali ka, dali ka. Grabe, this is sobrang my type of food. Ay, ay. Oh. Cheese sauce. Ay, sorry. Tapos may extra extra yan. Try mo lang. Cheese sauce with extra extra. Bacon, par, 'di ba? Napakatindi. Uy. Uy. Truffle sa una ko na amoy. Uy. Asan na ba kayo? Sayang. Grabe, sobrang sarap yata. Boy, tumigis yun. Cheesy bacon upgraded. Such a childhood. Yep. Super kid friendly. Yes. Okay, pass around. Pass around. Okay, ako na mag-shoot. Boom, gun 60 seconds. So usually kasi dami yung sobrang ingredients So Jeric decided to make like a paella style with everything in it So sayang diba para walang tapon Plus the battery stock Quiet na lang Secret Sa vlog na lang malalaman May steak pa tayo May steak pa Oh my god Ang gagawin ko ngayon is just runny eggs So Warm pan Whisk your eggs in So, guys, sa cooking, walang exact recipe, walang perfect scenario. So, ang kwe, what's happening here is, this is the leftover from the oyster scrambled eggs that we made. Kim, tutus tara. Oh, tutus tara. But we're going to run the eggs with cheese. So, tutus tain ko na lang to para may texture tayo sa runny eggs natin. May texture two different flavors from the same yeah. ingredient. No? Oh. Yung tusta niya, kunin mo. Sarap yan. Ang natutunan ko today is pag hindi mo pala, pag yung kawali na pinagluto mo ng itlog, huwag nyo munang hugasan. Kunin nyo itong tusta. Masarap to. Dagdagan mo lang ng oil. Alam mo, when you make fried rice, di pa sa ilalim yung tusta. Masarap. Eggs in. Then, dito na tayo. Ito gusto natin runny na. So, you know, you have two textures. Always, always keep stirring. Then, I will add cheese to this in a bit. Pero, papaset ko muna siya. So, actually, pag gumagawa kayo ng runny eggs sa bahay, cold pan, put the eggs in, whisk, and then turn on the heat. So, you don't need a bowl. And, add lots of butter. Pag may cheese powder kayo, you can dami niyang applications. Treat it like a like yun like the mushroom powder, like a chicken powder. Pero konte lang na hindi nila mahalata na cheese pala yung ginamit. Say fried rice, little bit lang, kasi nandyan yung umami. Okay, look oh, so it's starting to set. Pag medyo nagseset na ng konte, pwede niyo siya i lift from the heat para babagal yung cook cooking niya. Balik ko siya ulit kasi medyo basa pa. Then always use wooden spoon or a rubber spatula. And of course, teflon pan. Grabe, it's so nice. The sun is out. Grabe. Pero what a, what a great weekend. Less than 24 hours. No? Pero super fun. Kim is getting more cheese. That's a good sign. If the chef is eating stuff in the kitchen, then it must be good. Because like the what Ryan was saying yesterday, like kami mga kusinero, yung kinakain namin after a long day is something not from our kitchen. And normally it's like, you know, bad stuff, junk food and whatnot. I'll add more. That's it. Beautiful. And let us plate this beautiful omelette. So just like so. Oh, that is so ready. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Since na magjoan naman kayo. Hmm. Oh God, I love eggs. Those are good. Eggs in the morning. Balik tadi naman kami naman na huli. Siya naman na una. Talo walang niluto ko eh. Cakap late pasah nagi sing. Tapos tingnan mo yung ngiti niya, oh, ang ganda. Kasi nakaluwa siya from the city. Picture dito, Ian. Umuulan na. Joel, hurry, hurry. Come, come, come. One, two, three. Chef, andayin mo niluto. 
Ang dami mo rin niluto? Hindi, dalawa rin niluto ko, sinahin ko yung isa. Ang dami mong ginawang kape? <laughs> Assorted sausage, then meron tayong supposedly a grilled lempo, now a sauteed lempo kasi umuulan kanina. So pinirito na natin lempo which turned out nice. Mm -hmm. Then meron tayo ginawa ni Kim, like an oyster omelet. Okay, wow. And then yung rice natin, garlic rice topped with uh, cured meat with lots of garlic. Stingray, ginawa ni Chef Jeric ng daing, uh, ng, parang naging daing na siya, no? Mm. So ito yung suka niya. Pero yung suka para naman sa lahat. So, liempo sa lahat. Ang kanin ko talaga sa bahay, quinoa talaga. Yung talaga kasi diabetic nga ako since I was 18 years old. So ito talaga ang kinakain ko. So nagdala kami kasi wala namang excuse para hindi ako makakain yung sa labas. Diba? Meron tayo dito ng uh, ensalada lang dapat to na normal na itog na maalat, kamatis, ganyan. Chef JP lumapit, meron daw siyang oysters. So sabi, isotay daw, ilagay dyan. So ginawa ko. Eh kahit anong gawin ko, hindi matuyo yung oysters. Diba? So nagkaroon ng... Nagkaroon ng parang sabaw and ginawa namin siyang oyster sauce. Bali, truffle oil yung ginamit, truffle, camp, camp made truffle oyster sauce na nilagay din natin yan. So medyo may hint ng sweetness to. Matitikman nyo mamaya, di ba? So yun lang yung dalawang uh, ginawa ko. Chef, ano pa iba mong ginawa? Ngayon, Chef, yung di ba, may tira tayo mga seafood. Mm -hmm. Oo. Ginawa ko nun siya style, ano, parang, paella style. Paella pilaf, gano'n. Balintiana-ish. Yeah. Tapos ito, meron tayong runny eggs Uy. with cheese. Oh! And meron tayong uh, Wagyu, a uh, grade A4 from Uncle that we're cooking a la minute. Oh. So, Ito, yeah, no? have this first and then... A4 Wagyu, Chef JP lang naman. Hindi, Uncle, Uncle. Uncle, Uncle. Uncle, Uncle maraming salamat po sa A4 Wagyu. Dahil sa happy, di ba? Yes, oo, oh, happy. Baka naman, Gamtek. Baka naman. <laughs> 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 Chef, what's the cheese for? Anyway. Uh, everything. For everything. With the egg? But the, no, the egg, egg, egg matrix na yan. So you put it in with your sausage. Ah. Shut, shut, shut. Ay, grabe. The egg. May truffle. Yeah. Ang <laughs> daya. Level up the experience of the egg, man. But it's just may truffle. The best. Yeah. Tingin nga, tingin nga sa mga. Yan, no? Oo. Oh. Ang lupit. Uh, A for Wagyu sa camp. Maraming maraming salamat, Uncle. And syempre, Chef Tim. Ngayon, balik tayo dito sa aking hindi A for breakfast. Nice. Yung ano niya, no? Ikaw na kaya dyan, ah. Pasahan daw, Chef. Diyo na pahiya. It melts in your mouth. Mga mamaya, puro yabang kasi mahirap. Ito yung pahabol meal. Seared. Salt and pepper. Cooked beer mirror. Yun lang. Donated by uncle himself. Donated? Yes. Donated. Given. Alright, make out uncle. Wait, let me just sprinkle some cheese over you. Alright, and then grab a piece. Ayan. Or medium rare? Medium rare or medium. Mm. Wow. Hmm. Thank you, Uncle. Wow. I want to experience what you just experienced. Wow, it's good. Mm. 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 Uh, I am very, very happy. Overwhelmed. Tapos, I guess ito yung mga moments na to priceless. Kahit na less than 24 hours, pero it feels like isang linggo kayo yung nagsama-sama and all got along. And diba nakita mo sa mga faces nila that they really, really enjoyed. It's such a nice feeling na bilang kusinero, napasaya namin yung weekend nyo. And I guess that's the beauty of hanging out with Ninong Rice Group kasi they're always laughing. With this guy, nahabi talaga, nakakahawa siya sa good energy niya, ang saya niyang kasama, dami ka rin matutunan sa kanya. Sabi niyang technical pagdating sa pagluluto. Oo, nagpapatawa siya. Pero bilang kusinero, I respect him so much. And hindi lang ako, ah, marami rin akong mga kilalang kusinero that watches his videos because they learn from him. At the same time, being entertained. Nag-iisang Ninong Ray. He's one in a million. Minsan ka lang makamit na ganitong klaseng tao. Kompleto, grabe. Hindi lang siya kusinero. All in one siya. Just like his rig. We're so blessed na kami yung kasama niya. Joel Pedro. Nag-iisang Joel Pedro rin. Imagine that blue truck. He set it up in a day. One day, kinuha niya sa shop, sinetap niya for this overnight trip just to make everyone happy. Grabe. Salamat. Salamat. May, yung may pospa yung walk away ko eh. 